Hello, Miss Oshner. I uh, finally decoded how to do this problem. So I'm going to teach you how to graph this complex number on a polar grid and then express it in rectangular form. So, the thing that threw me off was the 3 because I knew that the 2 was the radius or the r and the 3 even though it is in radians needed to be put in degrees so you could approximate it. So what I did is I did that so I did 3 times 180 over pi and that's 171.89 so once you get that you can go on the 2 ring right here and go to 171.89 which is almost to 180 degrees right about here and that's how you graph it so now to find the rectangular form of it you want to do two. you want to multiply by cosine and sine so it's r cosine theta and r sine theta so the r which is 2 cosine theta which is 171 when you do that you get negative 1.98 which is that, and then the second part, the imaginary number is 2 sine of 171.89 which is 0 0.28 and that's how you get the second number. So, that is how you solve this simple problem disguised as a very hard problem. Thank you.